I, uh, I, did a, I did a head count of all my friends that are still single. What? Me. That's it. <laughs> I turned 35 a little while ago. Thank you. I'm in the best shape of somebody's life. <laughs> and I'm realizing a lot of things in my 30s. I'm realizing that, yeah, I'm the only one of my friends who doesn't have a wife or a girlfriend. And all my friends are married or getting married. Uh, and, and it's great and I support it and everything. But I'm realizing when you are the only one in your group of friends who doesn't have a wife or girlfriend, as long as I have in my 30s, you automatically transition into being that guy that then your friends watch your girlfriends trust. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> I, mean, I called my buddy Dave the other day and said, hey man, you want to hang out tonight? I could literally hear his wife in the back going, is that Steven? <laughs> Tonight, let me guess, he wants to go bang some whores. <laughs> yes, he <it> would. <laughs> and I'm like, dude, come on. And he's like, I'm sorry, Steve. I'll calm her down. I'll calm her down. What did you want to do tonight anyway? <laughs> on it because it feels like it feels like a dirty adult version of duck duck goose. <laughs> Damn, goose. <laughs> and girls, I, I, I get it, I get it. The online dating thing, it's creepy if you're a woman, because uh, guys are just like I have uh, female friends that show me messages from guys and they get and, and for whatever reason, for whatever reason, guys within like the first or second sentence, like the girls like, hey, how's it going? And guys are just like, wanna see my dick? Like, <laughs> I don't know, I apologize on behalf of my, I'm sorry. I couldn't be that creepy even if I tried. I'd wait like a gentleman until she asked for a picture of it. What? But, <laughs> but, like, I get it. Like, I'd much rather, like, it, I'd rather talk to a girl face to face and hopefully, hopefully that way convince her that I'm not creepy. But over at Keyboard, it's tough. I struggle with it because I get it. You've been hit on by 30 other assholes. How am I supposed to separate myself from that herd of guy? <laughs> like over at Keyboard, right? Because you're just expecting that. So I just get right to the point. I'm just like, hey, key profile picture. My name's Steve. It's blurry enough. Um, I'm going to convince her I'm not a creep. I'm not going to rape you, smiley face. <laughs> Don't send the winky face, but that's <laughs> <laughs> the just, But it's not always, it, now here's the thing too, is, is I, I did, I met a girl a little while ago, we went to talking, we took it from plenty of fish to texting, and, uh, yeah. and she said, she said we got a little flirty, and she was like, send me a naughty pic. Like, we haven't like, gone there yet, but she was the one that initiated She's like, send me a naughty pic. Now, uh, girls, you have to realize something. You, as women, have a whole, Galaxy of options. Of what, <laughs> of what can you consider not? You, know, like, you could have like a broken dish in the kitchen and be like, oopsie. <laughs> and then like, fuck yeah, oopsie. Like, we'll just find a way. <laughs> we'll find a way to. <laughs> I cheated on my taxes. Uh oh. Like, yeah. <laughs> Tony Norman, that T4 you didn't claim. <laughs> As a man, we just have one option. She like, sent me an audio picture. I was like, okay. Um. <laughs> <laughs> but it's not always the guys. Uh, it's not always the guys. It's not always the guys. Oh, it's on my name. It's like, it's the women sometimes. Sometimes it's the women that are. I was, I was in Kamloops a little while ago because fucking awesome. <laughs> And I, and I matched, I matched the girl, and uh, and and, and it's, yeah, I screenshot this. Can I, can I use you? Not use you, but like, unless, I, mean, I don't, whatever. Okay. <laughs> okay, so you read the, you read the blue part. Okay, this is a real legitimate match dinner thing, and uh, and I so I matched her and a lovely girl named Nicole, and I said, and I said, hi Nicole. I initiated the conversation because I'm one to do, and I said, I said, hi Nicole, how's your weekend? And and then she said. 
Uh, just read the blue part, the first, the top one. Oh, sorry. Ooh, how's, how's your dick? <laughs> read what was on the screen, but thank I that's what the girl said. I said, how's your weekend going? She said, how's your day? So right away I was like, what? So I was like, well, some of you guys here, they're the perfect ones, you're like, yeah, show her a picture, you show her a picture, no! From a gentleman, I just immediately said, I thought I'd be clever, and I said, haven't checked today, should still be there. What she said. The second, second blue. Um, uh, well, I'll check for you. <laughs> it's getting a little racy now. <laughs> because I'm a businessman, I was there for a show. I immediately dismissed that and said, you know what? Uh, I just gotta ha 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 it off. I come to the show, bring a couple friends, put you on a guest list, uh, whatever. And then, and then she do what she said. Um, uh, so I said all that, and then she said, the, the top blue there. Not read that one. Sorry. Just, 